Welcome my YouTube family. Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Tanya and I am on my way to the store to get some ingredients for a juice and I am bringing you along. We are going to the store and we are going to get some ingredients for a autumn juice. Fall is upon us. The air is crisp. The leaves are falling. And as such, we are going to juice ingredients that are in season, that are gonna be coming in season. You're welcome to continue to juice the juices we all love with the berries and the melons and all the other ingredients. As you get them and you get good, good ingredients, um, but we are going to be juicing items that are coming into season like pumpkin and squash and zucchini. We're going to be making some wholesome, warm, hearty, creamy juices. So that's what we're doing. I'm bringing you with me. I'm excited. Any excuse to put on my rain boots. We are going to be going to Sprouts to see what they have. So you guys, sorry for the shaky video. Of course I grabbed the worst cart in the store. It looks like brain shivers. I'm going through and picking up the ingredients needed for this juice and as I stated before, we are making a autumn juice, so you'll need some lemons. And I tried to get the best lemons I could possibly pick here. Um, that one looked really good, so I picked that one up. And I went back in for another one. Um, you will need two lemons. You'll need two sweet potatoes, two medium-sized sweet potatoes. Um, I did not peel my potatoes. I soaked them in a solution of vinegar and water. Um, next, you'll need some carrots. And of course, the first thing I saw was a big 10 pound bag of carrots, which I did not need. Um, so I grabbed a three pound bag of uh, carrots. Yeah, like I didn't need that many carrots, so. I went back and I got the smaller bag of carrots so yeah if you're gonna make a bunch of juice then get the bigger bag but I chose to get the smaller actually two pound bag I'm sorry I thought it was three pounds it's it was a two pound bag um, next you will need uh, two pears two apples um, make sure you are getting firm apples and firm Hairs because you don't want them to be mushy. Um, like I looked at these pears and I mean they they look good, but you know they were kind of soft and it, I went and I chose these. These are Bosch, B O S C H pears. I grabbed those, um, and of course you know I'll be cleaning all of these in a solution of vinegar and water. Um, these have got to be the shiniest apples I've ever seen. Uh, hence the reason why they need a good soak. And I don't always buy organic and these were not organic. So um, really, really shiny. They look like they polished them. Like, I, I, I don't know. They look like they polished them. So I'll be soaking them in a solution of vinegar and water. All of the produce will get a good cleaning and I got two English cucumbers, also called hothouse cucumbers. They're in plastic. Um, I went over extensively why I choose these. They save me a little bit of time. So I grabbed those um, instead of the regular cucumbers that are not in plastic. And those blueberries you saw were for me to snack on. We're all done. Let's get ready to check out. 
and head back to the house and get this juice going. For this juice, you'll need two sweet potatoes. And I did not peel the sweet potatoes. As you can see, I just peeled off the really crummy parts. Also, you will need six carrots. Um, how many carrots depends on you, but I chose six carrots. After I cleaned the carrots, I just chopped the top and the bottom off of the carrots. You will need two English cucumbers. And I did not peel them. You will need two pears and two apples. Make sure you're getting the firm apples and firm pears. You will need a thumb of ginger and one lemon. Make sure you peel your lemon if you don't want the tart taste. Let's get into this juice. So, after cleaning my produce, I put them in my juicer, starting with the sweet potatoes. I just chopped them up, um, not very small. They don't have to be very small because remember, you can put a large quantity in the Nama hopper. So I chopped up my sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes are high in fiber and antioxidants. Sweet potatoes are a blockbuster source of beta carotene, which is converted to vitamin A. And vitamin A supports good vision and your immune system. Sweet potatoes juice really well with carrots and they juice really well with apples. And you guys, this sweet potato, these sweet potatoes yielded good juice. Um, I was very impressed with how much juice I got from two medium-sized sweet potatoes. And typically you'll find that sweet potatoes are very starchy. Um, you can kind of see it in the juice a little bit. The little bit of white foam, that's the starchiness of the sweet potato. Um, as I said, it juices really well with carrots, juices really well with apples. And the pulp from this was so dry, I couldn't believe it was like sawdust. Next, I threw in some cucumbers, English cucumbers. Um, English cucumbers are also called hot house cucumbers or seedless cucumbers. Um, this variety is, they're long, they're thin, they have like the dark green, thin skin. You'll often find them wrapped in plastic at the supermarkets, but you still, you'll, you can find them unwrapped as well. Um, typically, at, you'll see them unwrapped at farmer's markets, but they don't have the wax on them.
Look at the consistency of this juice. Creamy. Okay, you guys, the autumn creamsicle juice is done. I got my ice, I stirred, and here we go. Let's look at that color. The consistency is kind of creamy, but not thick. You guys, delicious. That is hearty, delicious. The lemon isn't too overpowering. The starchiness of the sweet potato is just right. The carrot blends just right. Let me know what you would put in this juice. It's called Autumn Creamsicle, and I got it, the recipe, off of the NAMA website. Um, yeah, let me know what you would put in your Autumn Creamsicle juice. Um, I like it. The carrots hit just right. The sweet potatoes hit just right. Everything hits just right. Listen, if you found value in any of the content that you've seen in our videos, in this video, please like, comment, share, subscribe. Tell a friend if you've been here before. Thank you for coming back. If this is your first time here, welcome. Don't be a stranger. Until next time, be awesome. Be great. Amazing things will happen. All right, you guys, that is it for this video. I know I just said it. If you've been here before, thank you for coming back. If this is your first time here, please consider liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing our video if you found any value in the content. I don't know about calling this juice Autumn Creamsicle. After drinking it, I think I, I wanna call it sweet potato pie juice. That's what I think I'm gonna call it, sweet potato pie.